the crime, the corruption, and the cover-up. But now we know that he cannot protect our people or our country. We've just received these documents that Trudeau has been covering up for years. Documents related to a massive security breach at Trudeau government's most sensitive laboratory where the most dangerous viruses and pathogens are studied and handled. We have learned that the Trudeau government's head of pathogens was collaborating with members of Beijing's People's Liberation Army who were responsible for bioweapons and bioterrorism. We know now that uh, a People's Liberation Army official was able to gain personal access, walk in the door, look at computers, and have access to all of our most important vir virological secrets. Let me, do you think any of this is hyperbole? Read the report yourself. This is from government documents, the Trudeau government's own documents. It says here on page 142, Winnipeg lab scientist Dr. Chushal Pathogens Unit, the top person in that job, according to documents on page 242, quote, represents a serious and credible danger to the government of Canada as a whole, and in particular at facilities considered high security due to the potential for theft of dangerous materials attractive to terrorists and foreign entities that conduct espionage damage to the economic security of Canada, end quote. States further. I don't know. This is pretty this is pretty big stuff. He goes on to read the report a little bit more in depth. I tried to find where the report is and tried to find the actual link, but I haven't found it just yet, but I'm sure it's going to make the rounds at some point. So I'll be sure to drop this in the description at some point. So what do you think about that, folks? This is pretty big news. This is dangerous stuff that these scientists are dealing with. They had top secret access. They had top secret access and they shared it with the Chinese because they were working with the Chinese. They were clearly spies. But the thing was, the government knew. They knew and they didn't hold an inquiry. They didn't freak out and go holy shit we gotta lock things down they just kind of pretended it didn't happen and tried to hide it 